The Equal is a special purpose-built floating closed containment fish farm. We produce fish from egg to fry to fingerlings, from fingerlings to grow out. From grow out, we harvest and we process the fish right on the farm itself. We wanted very much to provide sustainable and healthy fish to feed Singaporeans. One component right up of the Equal is the water treatment. What we do is we filtrate the inlet water and we ozonate the water to kill all the pathogens. And in the middle of it, we have the grow-up tanks where we grow fish. We have an air lift system where we uh, allow the highly ozonated water to be mixed with the water that is in the tank to create a cyclonic action so that the fish can swim like they are in the ocean. Sustainability in the Equal have more than threefold. Not only do we use green energy, we ensure that all the system and the equipment we use are of low energy requirement because when you grow healthy fish, you need to exchange a lot of water. The second thing we rightly say is to use solar energy. Uh, we have BIPV, that means the roof of the eco arc is also the solar panel. The third part is this, we are the shortest food mile in Singapore. Uh, we are also the first farm in Singapore to have a license to process fish on board the farm. By so doing, we also save the carbon footprint. The last part of it, which is most important, and uh, it is also not found in all the farms in the world, is that the discharge water that we have are filtered through 100 micron, ozonated, and then discharged back to the sea. Uh, we harvest 100% of the rainwater, and inside that auxiliary room, is beside palm, is also our waste, our sewage treatment plant. Meaning to say, all the sewer that are left behind are treated and we ensure zero discharge of the human waste outside. So we have a true responsible discharge without polluting the sea as we grow fish. Uh, having said that we could not find investor was the first, and the journey became more challenging. They asked me, you have a choice, you want, to, you want us to invest or you want to remain in sustainability? So I said, well, I'll stay in sustainability. Uh, that's why one of our core values is called greed. You have to have guts to be able to start something that you think you want to do. So having said that, I'm thankful that our shareholders who trusted us let us move forward. Uh, the next thing that is really challenging is the cash flow. So sustainability is a very important agenda for DBS. It's something that is a journey that we need to transform ourselves and embed into it. We need to give the right tools, the right guidance to our SME. So it starts off with us helping them to identify the areas whereby they can grow in a sustainable manner and then adapt it as part of the agenda. But more importantly, walk that journey, partner them and then also equip them with solutions, even our financing ability so that they can take it as part of their business model. We believe in growing our SME. We believe in doing this together. I think the effort that Mr. Leo has put in in Ecoac is truly remarkable and respectable. He has put in a lot of effort and money into what he believes in. Uh, I think the highlight of, the, of my visit to the farm is really to see um, fishes being farmed in a very different way that I've never seen before. Um, I think consumer trends is already gearing towards sustainability, how to eat responsibly in a sustainable way. So we as businesses have to cater to that demand very quickly. Well, I think for a business looking into sustainability, without doubt, there are some costs involved, okay? Because it's about conversion, right? But then I think for long term, you know, it, it does benefit the business. Um, but now with the government support and the bank support, so why not? Why not we take advantage of it and, and, and take a step forward and start now? And then I think you will see your profit that you can reap in the future. I think sustainability is a very important model for any business because I think I can see that the younger generation are looking into food sustainability. Uh, they want to know where the source is from. So I think uh, sustainability is something that uh, all SME must look into.